What is up guys, Major Magpie here and welcome back to City Skylines. This is my city of Magtropolis. It's just looking mighty fine. Uh, yeah, it's been a while since the last episode guys. I've, uh, I've had a lot going on in my life. Uh, a lot of stuff has changed, but uh, yeah, that'll all become apparent in my very first vlog. I'm going to put a face to this channel, I think, in the next couple of days. Um, but yeah, anyways, on to this episode, guys. Uh, I did say it in the last episode that I was going to probably do a little bit more on the harbour, but we've done two harbour episodes in a row. Uh, so I think I'm probably going to skip this one. Uh, and I'm probably going to finish the harbour off calm. But what I want to do, the sun's about to come up, I believe, yep. I just want to go ahead and let the, start letting the water in here. Um, come back to that in a second. I'll just head over to what I would like to do in this episode, guys. And it involves this little part over here. Now, this has all been too straighty for me. I'm not sure whether that's a good way to describe it. But yeah, I've never been quite happy about this area over here. It's always just been straight up and down and just buildings growing aimlessly like that. Apart from this beautiful little thing here, which is the Sterling Residence. Hmm. Uh, yeah, this train line is what I would like to be tinkering with in this episode, guys. And it's going to involve putting in this beautiful little beastie. Oh, if I can just find them. It is going to be these, yeah. The sunken trench railway thingy majiggies. I want to put these in here. This should be cool. So, what we need to do before we can go ahead and do that is just kick these guys out. So, let's do that now. We'll just paint all of these dudes out. Get out. Leave. You're not welcome. Let's just get rid of all of these, all the way up, including you, and all of these as well. And what I am going to do, because I am aware that they're about to lose electricity, so I'm just going to connect this electric to there. Them guys should be fine, because I think these might lose electric. Uh, but yeah, right, where they're clear, and let's go ahead and just flatten the land where the harbour is then. This bit over here. I just want to start letting the water in here, because what I would like to do, if we've got this harbour here, I would like to have another harbour like that opposite, on that side. And then basically just mirror that in here. Yeah, in order to do that, we're going to need to let water in. I'm going to do all that off cam, but let's just open all of this up here. So, and we'll just smooth it, we'll just grow the tool a little bit, just smooth all of that. And there we go, and then while we're messing around over there, this can be filling up with water, which is cool. Okay then, who's still here and who hasn't gone? Uh, you can see I've already started setting a height for our new sunken railway bitty thing. We've got a police station here which will need to go. Uh, the road will have to go as well, so <laughs> luckily enough. Uh, let's get rid of that police station. Oh, sorry guys! Yeah, they're not happy. Uh, let's get rid of all of this line down here. So, it's all of that. All of that. Uh, you need to get out. Uh, we'll cut it back all the way up to about there, I think. For now, until we decide what's happening with that. I'm not overly sold on yet. Okay, right. Now we're going to need to set the height all the way through. And I can see straight away that these roads are not straight with the lines of the map, if that makes sense, but it doesn't bother us too much. Let's just flatten all of this. Uh, one thing that might be an issue, which I'm saying straight away, is I think these sunken things have to be laid on flat land. But if we just jump down, you can see that the road slopes away, so I might have to lift that all up to a flat height, but we'll see how it looks once I get it done. Before I start, like, count my chickens and changing stuff like that. Uh, let's just flatten as much of this as we can. Yeah, it's starting to get a bit hilly on this side again, so it is. It must just dish in the middle, which isn't too much of an issue. Yeah. Okay, right, we'll just leave it like that for the time being. What we need to go ahead and do now is put in some footpaths. Now these are just temporary for our um, little sunken railway things to stick to. So let's just switch on that. 
as straight and true to this as we can. So, something like that. Uh, probably to about yeah there. And I'm going to run another one parallel with that. Like so. Just to there. That's cool. I'm just going to pause time so we can keep it light. Because I don't like building in the dark. The only issue I want to say about that is it's not really central. I think what I might do is just put another path beside this. Like so. And then delete the first one. Just get rid of that. And delete all of this one here. Yeah, that'll be better. Right, okay. Let's get our song and real bits. Then we're going to start with this here. The Real Bit Tunnel 4 track. And I want to put that on here. Uh, about there, probably. Boom. Let's have a look at this then. Look at that. That's pretty awesome. That's pretty awesome. Right. Uh, we're going to need some side bits then. We've got two side bits to choose from. We have this bit here, which is a real bit trench. Uh, 4A. And this one here, which is just an empty trench, which is 4B. Uh, and I'm just going to mix them up and use them in different parts. So if we go one there, one there, and then do the other side as well. And there. Oops, that one's wrong straight away. Let's just have a look, quick look at this. Yeah, one side's right, one side's wrong. Oh, well, this bit's just there. That's all that's wrong, just that one. back in and um, we'll put another one there and then one about there uh, and we'll get the other one the, the 4a and we'll put that one there and then mimic it on the other side actually we could do that couldn't we let's have a look at this yeah i like that that looks awesome right i'm going to continue that all the way through there then Probably gonna want. Hmm. I might stop it about here. Yeah, well, I'm actually gonna stop it about there. So if we can just remove that and remove that. And what I would like to do is get a tunnel and put the tunnel on the end of here. Like so. Is that facing the right way? It is. Uh, and I'm probably going to have to lift all of the road up around it. But basically I want to run the road straight through there. So it continues. And then put a sunken train station on this side. Or maybe it's two. Two maybe. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Let's just continue this a little bit here. I'll just fill all of that up. So we just want the blank one. And one... And I think that's wrong. It is wrong. Too wrong. Take two. Right. About there. And then the same on the other side. Yeah, they look fine. <laughs> The other bits again, the little bridge crossing things. Just put them to there. there. And then we'll fill that gap with a couple of the blank ones. One, two, one, two. Let's have a look at this then. Look at that, that's pretty cool. I like that. That is awesome. Right, now what we need to do then is we need to get rid of the paths that's there so we lose the lampposts and replace them with train lines. So get our bulldoze tool and let's just remove the paths. Now I'll put the paths in because the path is all that these will attach to and they need to stick to the road in order for you to put them in. But I'm hoping that it doesn't start saying, oh, you know, no road access or whatever on them when we start playing time. But only time will tell and in which case I'll have to come up with an alternative solution to make them work. But... Yeah, let's just turn toggling off so we can get these central to like there, maybe. Yep. 
That's cool. Uh, and what I want to, want to do is just turn the camera and just get it straight in and there as well. So about there. Bam. Let's have a look at this. Look at that! <laughs> oh, yes. All right, let's just toggle that. See if we can just put one right in here. And the same again, through and into the tunnel, going in the other direction. I'll have to turn toggling off. But just do it there. Like that. That looks pretty damn cool. I've got to say. That is awesome. <laughs> Right, what I will need to do, uh, yeah, definitely going to have to lift all of this land up, I think. I'm going to have to flatten these bits as well. Let's just have a little play around with the height on this land. Let's just bring that to there. Yeah, look at it. <laughs> I'll just smooth the edges and everything will be hunky-dory, right? Yeah, I'm not going to go too wild with that because I will be. I will have to change the road height. Uh, I'll probably pick it all up to probably about this end height here that we've got over here. Uh, let's just clear time and see if we get any no road access on these things. I'm hoping we won't. Um, and there will be a bridge in here as well. Uh, I'll cont I will use this road for here. I'll continue to use it. But we're going to have to lift all of this, so it will mean taking everything from here out. All of these buildings will have to go. I'll probably go and do that off cam because it's nothing exciting, really. But I can show you about how it turns out, like the outcome, in probably not the next episode, but the one after. Because uh, the next episode, guys, I want to just do a little five to ten minute tour of. Our new look airport because I have been busy adding more detail to it uh, and it is very time consuming because of the amount of mods I have installed it's backwards and forwards for the menu it takes forever so uh, it's probably a third of the way done uh, but yeah I'll showcase that in like a little five minute episode in the next one um, but yeah one other thing I would like to do uh, or two other things I would like to do in this episode is one is a unique building in here because it's something else I want to do off calm again again It's going to be tedious. So we just find the building. I've already pre-selected. It's this thing here the gate financial center uh, And I want to place this here as you can see this has like a highway road that runs through it And I want to connect it from this road here Down to our roundabout. I think if I can make it look and work okay Time will tell. I want to put that in here anyways and then I can go ahead and connect that off cam because that is going to be uh, time consuming and also tedious. So 75 grand. Bang. Let's have a look at this. Yeah, that's, that's all right. I like the idea that the road runs through it. That's why I've chosen it anyways. Um, but I will have to reshape all of this land around here and eventually go ahead and connect this road on here because at the minute there's kind of only one way in to here <laughs> and there's no way of getting out because this is a one-way road so you bring your car in and then well yeah you just leave your car in <laughs> but yeah look we'll at that sorted and uh, right so that's that unique building and the next thing i do want to do quickly is a prison now i've wanted to do this for a little while now and it will help our city out uh, so i've decided i'm going to put it over here this is a nice little plot for it so we're going to need to put in some roads first of all yeah uh, we're just going to go over a little Two-lane road with a grass verge. Yeah, why not? Grass verge it is. Uh, run it straight up to about there. Just run it in either direction. So one that way, one that way. A little bit further up there. Across there and back down. Probably a little bit too tall. Let's get rid of that. That's better. And bits. Right, what I want to do is just put our prison central with this road here. So let's go and find it. Should be in police stuffs. 
and it's oh, two prisons. It's not that one. It is this one here, I believe. Uh, the prison is a correctional facility to transform criminals into law-abiding citizens. Police stations have jails to hold criminals for a short time, but a prison is needed to rehabilitate them. Uh, so yeah, we want to put this there. The Senate can get it. 120,000? Bang! It's just like pocket change to us now. We've got so much money. <laughs> Although we are making a, lot of, a loss of 16 grand, so I probably shouldn't speak too soon. Uh, right, okay. What I want to do is just shorten this road here. So if we can just run a a road there and, and then a, oh, and then a road there as well and then just remove these end bits here and there we go. let's just zoom in and see the state of this place it needs water and electric okay it's yeah it's like a something of a horror film you know it's haunted and <laughs> something of a, like a, a an apocalypse film or something I don't know uh, okay, what I can go ahead and do now is just put a wall around this and some trees and stuff and everything will be cool and it'll look awesome. Now let's just give these guys some amenities then while they're over here. We might as well. Yeah, so let's just run water to you. There you go, it should be connected. I'm um, gonna give them a bit of electric because I am feeling generous. I figured it might come in handy so you can see what your crims are up to, so... Yeah, right, there we go. That is that done. It's good to get a prison. The power lines will go eventually, but once I've decided what is happening with it. Uh, in the coming episodes, we're going to have to do something about yeah. This has kind of been neglected and forgotten about. I'm not too sure what whether I've got too many tram lines here. So I was thinking I might go ahead and delete this line running through here, but I'm not completely sold on it. So I'll still think about it. Um, but I would like to give these guys a train station as well. Probably over here where it's a bit flatter. Uh, but again, I'm not sold on it. Uh, I don't think there's much else we can do in this episode. There is so many things I want to do. I want to put a zoo in. Uh, I want to go with a little resort island I want to go in. Uh, the zoo, I do want to put in here. So, but I need these buildings for to unlock a building that I want to put place in. So this needs to be full, all of them, all of these ceremonies need to be full for us to unlock the building that I want to put in, then I put the building in and then remove these guys. And then the zoo can go here, so, <laughs> but they are taking forever to fill up, so I don't know what the, what the crack is with that. I need to revisit our race track again at some point in the near future. Uh, but I was thinking maybe it's in the next episode, guys, we can go ahead and put in some, where are they? These little things here, yeah. toll booths. I did want to do this like way back in like episode 70 or something. But I would like to go and put these guys in. I want to put one on each entrance into the city. So a little bit over here as well. A couple over here. But yeah, I'm just going to leave it here, guys. Uh, I can have a tinker with the heights on this off cam and, and show you how I've gotten on. But uh, yes, guys, until the next one. Thanks a lot for watching.